See? Everything looks better on a full belly. Swimming shorts don't. And Dingle made a gag. A weak one, but he made it. Yeah, well, like I said, it's only going to be a little bit longer and then we'll be home, so not much can happen between now and then. Who's this? Hello. Yeah, is that, who's this? She's what? Was she all right? Look, I'm not too bothered about that at the minute, mate. I just said, is she all right? Yeah, yeah, of course I can. Yeah, cheers. What was that? That's me eating my words. I need my car. You OK? Yeah. Quick tip for prison life. Fighting's not going to make you very popular. Brilliant. There's that delivery of sarcasm I ordered. Well? Well, I could do without people punching me. I'd imagine she only punched you because you punched her first. The warden told me that you started it. So grass. So what was it about? Well, they wouldn't let me see you, would they? That's because you said no to the visiting orders. Well, then Stephen spoke to me and, and Chaz made me see since yesterday and, and, and this lot still wouldn't let me see till next week. It's already Thursday. Felt like a long time. Is that bad? Yeah, it's all lit. Well, that's what happens if you get yourself in a fight. Hers is worse. <laughs> is that supposed to make me proud? I am glad you wanted to see me, though. No matter how many people it took to convince you. I might have been a bit harsh on you. Things I said. I've been told worse. So you done being mad at me? What do you think? Well, I guess we'll probably find out in about three seconds. This drinking. Yeah, it's a bit of a problem. Are you being sarcastic? Or... No. I'm not. So how badly are you into it? Well, I like it. I like the effect of it, anyway. Not had any in here, though, so it's not like I'm shaking and gibbering anymore. Well, the real test will be when you get out, won't it? And I'll be there, whatever you need. I need you to give yourself a break. That's why, you know, I said I'd tie stuff last time. You told me a few things, don't worry about that. Yeah, I know. It was easier to do that than admit I've got a problem. It's done now. I don't want to keep secrets. Steve says do one thing at a time, one step at a time. Like, I don't want to drink and I want to do well at this school stuff. That's good news. I don't want to be left behind. And for the sake of one year dossing around, I don't want to look back in 70 and think, if only. Do you think you'll pass your exams? Don't know. So you reckon I might just scrape through? I mean, you can take them again, though. I'll actually put some work in and build a future, whatever. <laughs> I don't know where this attitude has come from, but I like it. Yeah, well, it's not going to come overnight, and that's OK. Steve says there's this really weird Japanese phrase, you fall down seven times, get up eight. Which doesn't make sense, because surely if you fall down seven times, you only need to get up. Seven times, yeah. <laughs> Sounds like Steve's got it all worked out. Yeah. Not gonna have a Steve on the outside, though, am I? <laughs>